Hi guys, I'm here with teammate today, and I'm gonna be testing out my. I I I, I tested out this the portable DVD player in um last night's video. It, it it only works when it's on charge and it gets really hot too quick. So um that's just gonna be my backup emergency player in case this goes wrong. But I'm gonna be testing out my new DVDs I received. I received Little Mermaid 2. And the Little Mermaid Ariel's Beginning, or the Little Mermaid 3, or whatever you want to call it. And I've owned the original Little Mermaid DVD for years, but I'm going to... I'm going to be testing these, not in movie order, I'm going to do them in timeline order. So in timeline order, it's the Little Mermaid Ariel's Beginning. Then the Little Mermaid, and then the Little Mermaid too. Right, the Little Mermaid area was beginning. What you got to say, teammate? I'll say, hurry up and get it on. All right. No, be gentle. It's yeah. obviously not in properly. <laughs> oh. uh, let us switch again. Oh. Uh, let us switch again. Oh. 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 Nah, ma, Dinky in the corner. It's called Betty. Oh, who's that? Is that Betty? Okay, so for Little Mermaid, everyone's beginning. The one I'm going to test first. Can I put my phone on here? No. No, I don't know that. Click OK. Now I watching a load of rubbish on TV. Oh. We've done this intro in the Jungle Book 2 DVD. Yeah, I think making the final already uh, available on DVD and Blu ray. That's good, isn't it, teammate? Yeah, brilliant. Oh, Disney DVD. My favourite moment, my favourite thing about the Disney DVDs. Shut up, teammate. What are you laughing at? You're a dick. Oh, this is the same as flipping Jungle Book 2's fast play. And also, um, Ew, they stink. Next. Let's skip like this. No. I'm really enjoying uh, the work that I do with the yeah. team okay. and with the staff and the FA and uh, I don't have any place to leave. Did you ever consider going into the men's game? Maybe an international team or a club team? I work now in the best environment possible. Um, I work with the best players all over the floor as it is. 
So uh, Princess and the Frog, I hate this movie. So it's not the same fast player as Jungle Book 2. No, I haven't. Um, and it's and of course, the bloody hell is this? I've missed is this think about What's this? Oh, I've seen this trailer for this film too many times. Disney DVD! Who is a bloody hell watches the news these days? It's a load of rubbish. Nama, turn it off. Let me skip to the end of the film. I still want more DVD tests. Oh, what a aim again. Wally. Next. Oh, this is rubbish. No, it's a clip on the film. Delete it soon. So what ended up happening eventually is we figured out, oh, let's make it musical trap doors. So what you're going to see now is basically a really first draft trap version of aerial falling. At this butcher's shop in East London, they say that with many people cutting back on things, they decided to reintroduce cash, having previously only taken cards. I've noticed quite a few more customers 
have been paying in cash, and I believe it could be due to the cost of living crisis, as it's easier want? to see how much money you have than you have it Richard all in cash and in the market nearby, like a final, the sum of cash is coming back. Next. I've gone back to going to the cash machine, drawing out a lump sum of money, and using cash because... Backstage Disney. What? But not everyone's convinced. Can you remember when you last used cash? Oh, literally, I've been trolling nowadays. <laughs> um, very rarely. Yeah, must be at least a couple of years. For many, card is still king. The BB night of news is London. Covid booster vaccines could be sold privately for the first time in the UK after health officials said they supported the move. As soon as next spring, the jab could be sold by Little Mummy from Stage. The flu vaccine. I think every girl dreams has scaled back from the end of the spring. Okay. I want to skip this for now. I'm going to watch this all off camera. This is catchy. This is catchy. Yeah. Beach thing. Yeah. Right, we're gonna put little mermaid next. Sales at the Victoria Coffee Lounge near the seafront were twenty percent down on their expectations for July. I just gonna give a slight dip into uh, the poorly weather that we've been having and um, the cost of living crisis is very real. Oh yeah, the Jungle Book 2 is in the little map of the case. Italiano. Today's figures could also suggest a growing unpredictability in the way consumers decide how they shop. Yeah, from the surface, it looks like it's a yo-yo effect this year in terms of how we're shopping, but the emotional Oh, the Jungle Book. I wanna be like you. Ooh, ooh. One, two, three, four. Oh, 
I was waiting to find a DVD of a trailer for Jungle Book. One of the simple bare necessities. Stop being on about me! I'm going to take all that money to sell it. Love you. Next. One of their close friends passed away, aged 65. One of the creators of Tangled and Wreck-It Ralph. Listen, you're writing that today. We have to have a sign to say we to do them. Oh, yeah. Can you want a cup of tea now, James? I'm going to call it later. Thank you. One night in the fifties. No. One woman born in the night in the fifties. For fifty years. One film has defined Disney magic. Is this Peter Pan? We're going to find Academy Awards. Old Disney's crowning achievement. Classic. Nope. I hate this movie ever. Disney's 20th anniversary at the time. Next. Okay, that's it for the trailers. They're all finished. And you're about to see is a longer version of the opening song, Battles Below. Howard Allen originally wrote this as a bigger production number uh, with singing and dancing, um, and even some exposition that was cut where, where we learned that Ursula the Sea Witch is King Triton's sister. Uh, the reason this song was cut down was uh, we just wanted to uh, simplify the opening and get into the story sooner. Yeah. 
In this deleted scene, you're going to see an alternate version of the climax of the movie where Eric battles Ursula and dispatches her. Among the things you can look for are a piano score by Alan Menken that he played sort of solo on the piano. You've got um, teammate, that's you. scale relationships that were ultimately in the movie, which was giant. And here we did a more human scale. And then this plays out to the final scene where King Triton is going to turn Ariel once and for all into a human. But you'll notice there's different dialogue in there, and in fact, Howard Ashman is doing the scratch voice for the king in this scene. This is the king. Oh, it's going to mind. There's nothing on there. I'm a total. It's day in, day out. Oh, it is this Little Mermaid game for Nintendo Wii or something? Evil! Evil! Yeah! Evil. 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 I'll have to 3DS if I do that again. Just the DVD menu. 0% APR with 30% minimum deposit. Mm. Oh, Nama. Got one more DVD to look at. And that's the Little Mermaid 2 Return to the Sea. Oh, well, yeah. That's all. No. The Little Mermaid 2, Ariel, no. The Little Mermaid 2, Return to the Sea. Weekend for many, so Storm Betty comes with a fair number of bad warnings, of course, for winds and rain. We've also got a thunderstorm warning in force as well. That's a little bit scary. Mom, I'm going to send it to you. Hold on, guys. Okay. To view this disc in English, press here. Thunderstorm warning sits out towards the east. By the time we get to tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow evening, though, the centre of the storm is going to be. Yes, no, I don't want it. I'm waiting in English. Trying to make me watch the film in some foreign language. Trying to make me watch this DVD in some foreign language. And I want to watch it in foreign, Emma. I want to watch it in English. I've got 10 minutes before I'm hoping to go play computer with Wyatt upstairs. Here's I am. There are no others. So this is the situation. Close your eyes. This time, what do you feel? I said, good story. That doesn't make it much sense. Leave it to me. Are you serious? Why are you this DVD is a bit crashy, this movie. I'm not interested in Tarzan. No, no. It's crashed. This DVD was a scat. Why is my DVD movie not working? The player's fine. 
Oh, right, that's good to say. Jumping ahead then to Sunday, oh, and it's a lovely yeah. start to the day for many. Thank you, Elf. Thank you. 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 Thank and finally tonight, the year 1966. It might be mentioned just a few times in the coming days. That is because we'll, for the first we'll. time in nearly six well, decades, England could have been the world, we read this, this in. world champions. When they take to the pitch in Sydney on Sunday morning, the Lionesses know that in homes, pubs and even churches, millions will be watching on and dreaming. Amy Lewis has been taking... Why is it not? It's not like you to go for the record. Coming to video and Disney DVD. The bunting is ready. Ready to poo? Oh, yeah. You can do it. You can do it. Nah. Oh, it's the DVD menu. Okay. Oh, that works. You can do it as well. One Sunday anyway. So, any it's fantastic. Any, cool. any well, even if it's 24 hours. Bonus material. Which is obviously very precious. Jill Sell, Chris Lockwood and Leah oh, this is... know exactly what it's like to line up in the World Cup for England. In 1971, they played in front of 85,000 fans in Mexico, only to return home right. and be banned by the Women's FA, who didn't officially recognise the tournament. Right. A lot has changed since they started out. I'm going to be back. I want to skip through this film quick to see if the actual bad. film itself crashes. Oh, well, guys, there's nothing at the end of the film, it's like, no... Well. Extra scenes. So, I'm at another video there. Bye bye.